Well, hello, dear colleagues, friends, and new members, and all the listeners uh, who are who are here and live right now with me. And uh, greetings to all of those as well who will see this presentation afterwards uh, via YouTube. Uh, hopefully, it will. Well, I'm doing all the best I can, so I will record this. A webinar and uh, hopefully it will be uploaded in YouTube. So hello everybody who is going to see that or who is viewing this a little bit more in the future. So uh, please uh, somebody press press plus uh, if if you if you hear me. Oh thanks Timo yes. All right so let us continue. I will go behind the curtains. I will close the close the webinar, hmm, my face facial view, and then uh, we will continue uh, only with the webinar, so you can concentrate more on the um, important uh, theme to topics and and uh, themes that I'm going to tell you about. So, what else? Wish you a blessed pleasant evening with me here and hopefully you will receive some new awesome news and inspiration that we are on the right boat at the right time and behind the screen so a little bit about me uh, my name is Michael and I have been investor and well a big fan and um, well inspired by this technology ever since i heard it it was around three years ago when i mm, well at first when i heard it i was so so happy and then uh, my eyes went glazing and then i started to research more and more about uh, about this technology to understand it more that's what i'm recommending to you as well if after if you if you're hearing this information for the first time or well you haven't heard a lot about it but you are kind of getting it if you know what i mean so you're kind of understanding that it is great but how great yet don't know then take a mm, breath in breath out and start searching information start asking the questions because then will the answers appear that's my recommendation for you so welcome to the 21st century and i think that's the main main thing about this technology that it is never made a uh, human kind has never made such technology it has made maybe similar by outlook maybe but if we are going to take a deeper look into the aspects of this technology, then we will understand that there is nothing similar at the moment uh, to Skyway, to, to our technology. And that's, well, there are, there are many reasons why. So as Dr. Anatoly Onisky, who is the creator of this technology, always says that we are approximately 10 years ahead of uh, of this uh, well in this industry all right let's let's move on well I, I, as you know the hmm, visioners artists mm, well actually artists have, have pictured the world in the future well almost always uh, well not always sorry but uh, have pictured the world like this as you see on the on the on this picture that uh, we are humankind is uh, traveling on the second level and this uh, certain picture is made more than 100 years ago by a vision and artist who imagined the future in 200 years um, well like you can see in this future like on this picture and um, well we are not far from this uh, world because as you know well, what I always like to say is that uh, in most of the biggest cities there are already metros, uh, subways under the well under the underground. Then there is a very good infrastructure for the first level on the ground floor, so to say, cars, taxis, um, buses, trolleybuses, uh, trains, and so on. But uh, still, the problems occur. There are still traffic jams, still still different. Uh, well. 
the accident rates are getting higher and higher, more cars are appearing on the streets. And that is why the only, well, the only real or uh, possible solution where we could go is on the second level. And um, well, we see this future not not in far away, but I, I believe in 10 years in most of the bigger cities, there will be second level transportation solutions. And Skyway, as Dr. Anatolianitsky always has said, that Skyway will take at least 50% of this market. So we are in the right boat at the right time and we can make right decisions for ourselves, for our next generations, children and so on. So, but more about that a little bit later. Well, yeah, as always already mentioned, people have tried multiple times in the past to rise above the ground with transportation, so it would be possible to go quickly over, for example, mines or rivers or forests. Um, but all those past technologies are extremely massive. Uh, honestly, uh, ladies and gentlemen, those are extremely massive and expensive to construct. I have done several um, uh, scientific researches, um, well, because I, I was, uh, I recently graduated from a Estonian only private business school and <clears throat> there I had to do scientific researches um, approximately 20 to 40 pages long. So I have done thorough researches about these technologies and, and what can I say is that Scout, there is no technology that can uh, Mm, that can cost less, less for example, that, that is cheaper than Skyway. But, uh, mm, but Skyway, the rice versus the Skyway has as much more benefits than all the other technologies. So it's cheaper and it has more benefits. So it's, it's either way is win-win situation for us. And for example, this railroad was built last century in Germany. And this one in China, and it's still in use, but uh, well, this train has wheels above, above, uh, above it, um, on the roof, so to say, and comparing to normal ones, the only difference, sorry, <coughs> the only difference is that they, it takes less space and nothing else. And this technology on the picture, well, this technology me mechani mechanism uh, is based on chains which move the vehicles. So basically, as you see the arrows, the white arrows, they, they are pointed to the chains. Those chains move and that's because, uh, and because of that, the vehicles also move. But Skyway has the motor wheels inside the machine. So the road structure is still, but the vehicles move. So that's the main difference. And I believe you can see this in uh, in bigger maybe ski resorts or, or so on. Yes, and here it is, Skyway Technology. All its five uh, currently, well, certified and um, ready technology models. Models, yes. Unibus, high-speed Unibus, Uniwind, you can see in the middle behind uh, double Unibus. Then uh, uh, further away, uh, up high there is Unicar and down below there is also Unibus. So there are many, many different Unibus models. And Unicars, now we know that we have uh, also Tropical Unicar, but uh, more about that a little bit later. Oh, sorry, I haven't showed you any pictures. I saw pictures on my screen, but uh, that's weird. So sorry about that uh, little mistake. But this one was the uh, was the technology which shows how massive it is. This one was in Germany last century. This one in China. This one uh, the chains which uh, move the wheel, uh, which are sorry the machine. And this is the picture I was describing you uh, recently. Sorry about that. I don't know why the lag appeared. But yeah, now let's move on. And uh, well, I said let's move on, but let's take a look in the uh, in the past. So uh, how it all started. So this man is Dr. Anatolioniski. He is behind the idea 
uh, of Skyway. He is general director and constructor and inventor. He is an engineer and space scientist who already 1966 received his first award for flying successfully model rocket into the sky with one passenger. And do you, uh, do you guess guess who who the passenger was or or yeah. It was a mouse, and so the, both the rocket and the mouse came back well. There was a parachute that opened, and the mouse was, was alive. So it was a successful event, and Anatoly Nitsky received many awards for that as well. He was a schoolboy back then, 14 or 15 years old, so quite young when he started uh, figuring out uh, how to build uh, stuff, so to say, inventions. And um, on his name is more than 150 inventions, more than 200 scientific work, for example, and more than 50 patents all around the world, and many more awards, which I'm going to tell you a little bit later. And this is, um, well, some of those patents, diplomas, awards, all of those can be seen as well in, in, um, in Belarus, Marina Korka, where he has a museum. Uh, on top of that, uh, there is uh, there is a station where, where you, well, I will show you a few pictures of that later. And this is his new website. I recommend all, all, all of you to go and see it with your own eyes and then read. Because if there is any questions you would like to ask, then uh, mo most most of the answers are, um, you can find find on that website. And already 19, back in the year 1973, he published his first paper about Skyway. Well, it was a scratch, so to say. And you can see this um, in the middle of this picture. And we can say that this can be one of the first marks of his idea to bring transportation system on the second level above the cars, houses, roads. So he was quite young, more than 40 years ago. He already understood that wh where we are going. Uh, brilliant mind, uh, I might say. And on the left side of this picture, you can see a mm, um, photo from from the year of 2004. This is Russian Zil uh, war machine, which was the first uh, demonstration truck, uh, which was um, implemented with multiple different wires and measure measure um, equipment to understand how this technology works or how this how his ideas uh, will uh, will uh, play out and this uh, war machine truck is possible to see uh, in Eco Techno Park in Belarus which uh, which construction started already 5 years ago i can't believe that it's already 5 years but uh, otherwise um, in the other sense we can we could, if if we if we think about it, that only five years ago we started from zero. There was nothing. There was only land, mm, and uh, this is a tank polygon. So where where they did some demonstration and and uh, well shoot out, so to say, when, when there was wartime, but it was basically nothing there, like a desert, like like a desert in the in the tropical climates. It was basically a similar situation in Belarus. And uh, within five years, we have managed to do quite quite a lot. So I will, I will show you. Yes, this is the picture. And already 2017, the first certified models were well the first the model the first two models were certified is, is the correct way to say it was a unibus and unibike which you can see on the picture and this is a huge step uh, for us because well if you know a little bit about technologies then you then you might have across the uh, information that it takes approximately five years to certify one um, model car one car, so to say, not model car, sorry, but one car. So it takes five years uh, when uh, from from starting from the start starting point to the point where people can drive it uh, on the road. So we did it within two years. 
So this shows how much pre-work has been done with the, with the Skyway, 40 years, as I, said, as I said before. And then the Golden Chariot. This is a, this is a most precious award for Unitskens uh, Skyway, since it's like an Oscar or, or like a uh, Grammy for uh, actors and musician, musicians. And Skyway, sorry, Anatoly Unitsky, together with Skyway, has received it and not only once but more than once and you can see all the awards as well on his website i showed you before and now two years ago took place a grand event called inner trans it, it took place in germany berlin and it takes place after after two years and uh, and skyway was uh, well it was one of the top or the main uh, companies which which received uh, views or or, or uh, clam clamorous uh, atmosphere uh, over it so it was a great and awesome event and you can see the videos as well uh, as well of this, of this event from youtube if you uh, click the if you type the well innotrans 2018 skyway into the youtube you, you will find the multiple different videos about it and I recommend also to see it because this is something which has never been done before and this technology this model on the picture goes up to 500 kilometers per hour can you imagine 500 kilometers per hour so if we have thought about let's say there is 300 kilometers uh, road to somewhere where you want to go and you say oh yeah it takes approximately uh, three to four hours when we think about Europe, but in Africa it takes approximately eight hours and in Asia in different regions where there are mountains and very well 40 kilometer average speed then it takes uh, eight to 12 hours to pass for a uh, three to four hundred kilometers so with Skyway it's possible to do um, le with less than one hour so I believe you can imagine how great this technology is and the interior as well you see it is so so elegant and and uh, beautiful well and then the screens and the comfortness and uh, uh, climate uh, climate so you can put on the warmth or the gold um, temperature inside and then the and the softness of the seats and uh, you can lower the seats and well it's brilliant it's so good and now let's move on 2018 already two years ago the beginning of construction of Skyway Innovation Center started so um, this is located on the territory of United States and the Arabic Emirates University, which has tens of thousands of students, among whom there will be new specialists um, for innovative skyway transportation system as well. So they will school and teach there in the university uh, about this technology and there will be new specialists. So you can see the future is, is really, really bright. And the center will be the second demonstration and certification center for Skyway. And this time it's in, as I said, in United Arab Emirates. The Sarja is located approximately 40 to 50 kilometers from Dubai. So it's very near next to Dubai uh, Emirates. And uh, there in Innovation Center, there will be multiple tracks. And the first one is 400 meters long, which is already ready and other tracks will be two and a half kilometer long and the first one of those two and a half kilometer long tracks uh, started uh, recently so congratulations to all of you as well and there will be almost all the different models and even more so for example the sea containers which you can see on this picture on the right side of this uh, slide there is um, both on both of them uh, on both of those uh, pictures on the right side you can see there is a blue cargo uh, sea container transportation system, and this will be a huge innovation, which which is um, a lot, uh, which is uh, awaited by the governments and by the well the industries because this makes it much more faster and uh, convenient to take cargo from point A to point B 
and then I will I will tell you a little bit more about this uh, later. But yes, there will be almost all the different models and even more. So it will be awesome. And why I said even more is because, as you see, these these are real pictures. So up uh, the three pictures on the upside, um, on the yes the above. So there is on the left side there is me and my partner Heli. In the middle there is. Uh, around one or two months later uh, well I was there until one or two months later they had uh, uh, well implemented these strings to the post what you can see is that this makes it really beautiful and on the right side uh, there is a first ever built wooden house in Arabic in United Arab Emirates so Never before has any company or, or every man um, in the history of United Arab Emirates built a wooden house there. But the Skyway is the first company, so this also shows our great relationship ships, uh, ship uh, with um, our well engine, our general engineer and contactor, Dr. Anton Unitsky has with with the government there. So it is it is brilliant. And 2019, this marks basically the. I'm holding my emotions uh, right now because uh, this this was this was the date when, which made our hearts very warm and uh, our faces very happy, and this uh, brought a lot of new investments also into the project because, this basically says that uh, there will be a 15 kilometer route in the in the center of Dubai so which will connect all, all the different uh, all the main points in Dubai uh, with the Skyway technology so this is a huge step for us and this um, contract was signed by Muhammad bin Rashid Al Maktoum who is a vice president and prime minister of uh, Arab United Arab Emirates of Dubai and United Arab Emirates and he's a ruler of Dubai so he's a great man you can google him as well and you will see that he's uh, well he I read a book about him when when I was in Dubai and uh, it showed there, there was uh, I saw a picture pictures um, where where there was only desert in Dubai and he, he is the man who, who started building this uh, great, well, how, how, would I, how would I say, em, empire uh, of, of, of what, we, what we see today there. He was the man who started it all. And last year also uh, uh, was held the premiere of Tropical Unicorn in Sarch Innovation Center. This you can see on the picture on the left side is Anatoly Nisk and on the right side is the mirror of Sharcha. So also very rich and powerful man, and uh, and this date marks or this uh, event marks the time when when the track was ready to so so the tropical unicorn could start moving. And here you can see the tropical unicorn. Last year also is special because ah, I believe you all recognize this man on the picture, at least uh, who, who has seen some action movies. This is uh, Steven Seagal, he's a famous actor and uh, he has a passion for all this um, well, green energy solutions and, and for the world overall. But he is also a, a United Nations Peace Ambassador and well our certification and demonstration park in Belarus was honored by him uh, last year and uh, this year also goes to history because Skyway was included among partners within the United Nations can you imagine we are uh, well Skyway we who are all our investors we are part of this family we are uh, we are the partners for, for United Nations so and basically this is uh, meant for a future project because as we know the European and world directives is, uh, well it's possible to read out from them that uh, we're going towards smart cities where we are only 
well basically no CO2 production will be will be made so only green energy solutions well from the sun from the wind you know, from uh, different generators which can produce electricity that moves the vehicles the skyway vehicles and there will be no CO2 which is actually awesome and uh, no other technology at the moment is doing this except for a few uh, some car car companies and the beginning of of the second phase as i mentioned before has started this means that uh, that the first route which was 400 meters long um, is finished and and two and a half kilometer long route uh, construction has started so they will will we'll see different models which need um, which are more heavier for example the sea container um, solutions solutions for for transporting sea containers and many others but um, well after after some months we, we will talk more about this and hopefully we'll see already well i have seen via facebook and youtube i have friends who well, visited the, the place. Well, the Sarch Innovation Center recently, and and made some uh, footages of the track. So there are basically already the the Meterian um, posts and Meterian uh, anchor supports are uh, placed. So it will be awesome when it's ready. And now a little bit more about the very recent news. Uh, so we have our own mobile solution now. So all of you who have um, Android, uh, oper um, well, the telephones which are app operating on Android system, so you can you can download the app and you can do all the necessary. Um, well, it has all the necessary functions. For you so basically you can make investments you can read the news you can share information with your friends and so on it is it, really awesome i i hope you you download it and you will take a look into it and a little bit uh smell it was kind of well i knew it it might happen uh, after the coronavirus and covid19 and all the pandemic started it was quite uh, understandable that this will happen. But I hoped uh, in my heart that uh, we will we will go there. We, we can go there this summer as well into the, uh, into Belarus to see all the all the models ourselves and try with those again. But uh, unfortunately, it it is Ecofest is postponed until 2021. So um, until then. Uh, if you go to our back office, you can see this awesome video there. So go to skyway.capital and log in and uh, they open the news section and you can see in the last week, I believe, was the, the news uh, came out or the video uh, video came out. Uh, so which which takes us back to the, to the, the time uh, last year. It is really awesome to remind us again what we are doing here and uh, which what we are helping with with our support it is something truly amazing and now something uh, very good question is that how to reduce the risk of breakdowns in the sky with transport because this is uh, this is uh, ask a lot so i will uh, tell you about this a little bit more and uh, well there has been released a new video about the work of the functional and system analysis bureau of of the skyway company developer and um, employees of this department perform several tasks first of all the analysis of uh, analyze the potential transport system failures they are processing algorithms for transport operation and they are preparing uh, the technical requirements and one of the latest developments in the bureau in, is the algorithm of the tropical unicars and U unibus hydraulic system self-diagnostics. So <laughs> I will say it again: hydraulic system self-diagnostics. So the algorithm is a sequence of actions by means of uh, which a fault in the transport system can be found. And you can get more details about the work of the Bureau of Functional and System Analysis in the new video in our back office. So take a look, I recommend to take a look. 
And now, also happy news. This video I really much enjoyed because there were a group of students who recently visited our production facilities. And, uh, well, the students were from the Belarusian State Technolog Technological Institute and uh, they are specializing in 3D modeling and work with composite mod materials and they and uh, and during the ex excursion the students talked to the specialist of the enterprise and saw the unique equipment for Belarus in work for example there is a CNC lathe by Akuma at the Skyway production facility that is the second such machine in Belarus the first one is used at the enterprise of military industry so this is very awesome and the company Unitsky String Tax Technologies uh, regularly cooperates with universities from different countries to support young scientists. And here, uh, and I will bring out some of these institutions, for example, Academy of Science of Belarus, then, then uh, Belarusian National Tec Technical University, then Belarusian State University of Transport, then Russian Transport University, M MIIT, then Ural Federal Un University, Slovak Technical University and British Institute of Technology of Wessex, for example. And the Skyway Innovation Center is also under construction in the UAA as part of such a science and technology park. And the Skyway Institute is planned to be opened there as well. So let's wait this. Awesome or awesome. And one of uh, one of the video which will will bring out the main aspects of this technology and and show us and demonstrate us or or bring out why Skyway is even smoother than uh, lux luxurious cars. And basically, uh, basically this video is 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 about the te te technical aspects of uh, Skyway. Mm. I will try to describe you more about this uh, video. So, this uh, uh, this well, basically, it is a, it is an overview of the rigid track structure that is behind the man. Uh, you can see the the deputy general designer for science, um, Sergei Artyushevsky. And according to Sergei, there was planned to build a, and this is really important information, there was planned to build a 17 kilometer long rigid track at the Ecotechno Park. However, the construction could not be implemented because of the protected marshes along the track, uh, track path. So because of that, the length of the existing track is only one kilometer. And because of the, that is one kilometer, we cannot uh, test higher speeds than 100 kilometers per hour. But the machines are possible, but it's possible to use these models to go uh, well in a city 150 kilometers per hour and the high speed unibus 500 kilometers per hour. And as Sergei noted, that the length of the rigid track at the Eco Park is not enough to test the high speed unibus at the speeds up to 500 kilometers per hour. And that is why today, congratulations, a new 22 kilometer long track is under development. So there will be a transport um, well, where the transport will be able to show maximum speed. And of course, again, more details from the video. This video is uh, four minutes and 20 seconds long, so I recommend you to take a look at it. So I thank you all for coming today. I will, uh, for, for today, it's, uh, I will finish. But the uh, next webinar will be held uh, on 13th of August uh, at the same time, 7 p.m. Minsk, Moscow time. And we'll talk about uh, more about the reasons why Skyway is uh, here to stay and why Skyway will be almost every, it will be implemented almost everywhere in the world. So the seven whys is the name of the presentation. And I recommend all of you to bring your colleagues and friends and the relatives to the presentation as well so they they will also hear and understand more about why skyway is the technology that that's going to rule in the world and how can we be a part of it so i'm sorry i haven't I hadn't told you before or today's presentation about the uh, offer 
but at the moment if you go to back office you can see there is a step up 2021 campaign which uh, which is basically a campaign where uh, it will last for about uh, 40 minutes more uh, for sorry 40 days more and uh, until that until then then we can we can receive shares um, twice or even three times more shares for the invest for our investments and this well basically we had chance to receive so much shares for our investments uh, approximately two years ago so this is something huge that the, our company has done for us maybe it's because of the COVID-19 so they could still move on and receive fuel so to say and or gas um, we, because uh, money is necessary to uh, to continue constructing and building the, the technology and um, and this is something special that is going on right now so after 40 days we will well we will never see such a great campaign so be sure to go your back office take a look at the campaign read the description of it and make yeah, make the best choice you can for yourself and for your family and for your uh, well next generations i thank you and i wish you a good night and see you next time Yes, Timo, thank you too.